Hey guys, it's Joanne. Hope everyone's having a good weekend. It's Saturday afternoon um, and I have a small Hobby Lobby haul. Um, now Hobby Lobby is about 45-50 minutes from my house and we were there yesterday and then again today. Um, we went looking for some home um, decor, wall hangings and pictures and you know little decorative things and um, got some things and then saw some things that, you know, we liked but didn't get, so decided to go back today to get them. But, um, the only crafty things I bought were, um, not those, um, some stencils. I've been looking for stencils. I ordered one online. Um, I don't really like the way that one turned out, um, but maybe I did it wrong. We'll see. Um, so these are different, three different kinds. Um, this is home decor show-offs, and this one this one seems like a plastic for the backing. Actually, you know, what? let's open it up and see. I tried a couple times with the stencils, and I just can't get it to work. Okay, so see now this one, um, it's not sticky on the back, and I know not all of them are, and. The one that I got that wasn't sticky, I tried to tape down and I painted it and the paint just went all, I don't know, I used too much paint, I'm not sure, but it bled through and looked terrible. Um, so, all right, so we have this one. And then I got two, let's see directions, we'll put that there. Two of these are Stencil Ease. Um, that's the brand on this one. Uh, this one says, I love you to the moon and back. I thought that one was cute. And then I got this one, farm fresh milk, dairy farm. Just a nice farmy stencil. Um, now these two are the same, but different than the other one. So let's see how these are. I had, oh see, this one's the same thing. I had one that I cut out on my brother and um on actual stencil paper that uh was sticky on the back and that one worked really good when i used it um this is the same so i have to tell you i'm kind of glad that i bought this stencil adhesive because i think that's what i need it'll glue the stencil down and we'll see how that works and then i bought this brush it's a stencil a stencil brush i don't know what makes it different than any other brush, but okay. And then we have one more. Now this one is by Show Offs, and this is an adhesive silk screen. So I'm not sure exactly how this one has a lot of instructions to it, and it almost seems like okay, let's open this one up. It almost seems like a material. Rip it. But let's see. So this one. Oh, this is weird. It's like all. I don't know. Maybe the paint will go through this part and not through the blue part. I don't know. I can't wait to try and use this one though. Peel off the backing, adhere to smooth, clean, non-porous surface. Remove carefully while paint is wet, clean and dry before reuse. So I can use them over again. Purpose, uh, ceramic, slate, stone, fabrics, glass, metal, terracotta, uh, paper, cardboard, and wood. So I can use it on pretty much anything. Um, although I have already painted the plaque. And the only reason I painted this was because when I did my other stencil and it bled through, I had to paint the whole black. black. So I have a different plan for this, but I guess the best way to start this is just with a fresh, fresh piece of wood. <clears throat> so I don't know how to really how to do this, but I'm going to figure it out. And then the only other thing I got were these permanent chalk markers. They were on clearance for $1.99. They didn't really have that uh, that much clearance at 
the, at this Hobby Lobby. I don't know, they had a really small section. Last time I was there, they had like a whole back wall. And then I did find some things more throughout the store on clearance, but I don't know, like I said, we weren't really there for anything crafty. I just took a quick look and I definitely wanted, you know, to get my stencils so that maybe I can finally figure this out and get to get to getting. So I hope you guys enjoyed my video um, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.